The financial crisis in Europe took a turn for the worse today. Standard & Poor's, the rating agency, downgraded the credit ratings of nine European countries. And if you think what happens there doesn't matter here, the Commerce Department reported today that U.S. exports to Europe plunged nearly 6% in November. Anthony Mason is here with more about the downgrade. Anthony? Scott, S&P sent a clear signal today that in its view, the European debt crisis is not over. More than half of the Eurozone countries were downgraded, including Italy, Portugal, and Spain, which had their credit ratings knocked down two notches, and Austria and France, which saw theirs cut by a notch. France, which was rated AAA, is now, like the U.S., a double A+. Standard & Poor's said Europe's attempts to solve its debt crisis were insufficient. Many of these countries remain on negative watch, which means they could be downgraded again. So what does it mean for our economy? It's got a default of a European country could cause a seizure in the whole financial system, which could topple banks literally around the world. It's essentially what we saw happen in 2008 with Lehman Brothers. Nobody wants to see it happen again. Anthony, thank you very much.